the pulpit. I told you, what you are going to think, that's exactly who you are. What is it? An angel is a servant. We are sons and daughters. Brother Nguna, this doesn't have to stumble you. If you hire someone to help your wife to clean the house and uh, to wipe the dishes and whatever, whatever, is that angel greater than Ayanda? Hmm? Who is greater? Ayanda. Because Ayanda is a child in, this, in that house. Everything in that, she can open every other drawer. If the maid does that, you look at her and say, Hmm. What is the most thought of your servant or your son or daughter? Oh my! Prayer from a saint will go a million times higher than that of an angel. Did you say yes, sir? Come, I want to pray for you for anything you want. Now, that's not an emotion what I did. I will share this quote on the group. When I said prayer from a saint will go a million times higher than an angel. Brother Branham in brackets, he says, yes, say. And the quotes will say the same thing. You, you said exactly what is on the quote. And you are not opening a tablet or whatever. You said it by inspiration. Just say the right thing. And all that you have ever desired will come before you. It will follow you. It will overtake you. And we will be beneficiaries of that. Uh, now I understand it, brother, sister. I can't preach anymore. I will preach this another time. Now I understand why. When sister Hattie Wright says, that's nothing but the truth. And there was such a presence in the church. And that presence is here. That presence is here. That presence is here. Ah, uh, my brother. If you believe me to be a pastor to this assembly, I can pray for you over any situation. And it will be exactly the way we pray. I can speak a blessing and you will be blessed. I can speak deliverance and you will be delivered. Because you believe it. Everything you desire, let it be so. You believe that? May it be so to you. Let's raise our hands. Heavenly Father. Yes, we heard about Sister Ra Hetty Wright. She shouted nothing but the truth, Brother Branham. And there was such a presence in the church. The Holy Ghost came down. And he said, Sister Hetty Wright, even a million dollars can fall on your lap. Ask what you will and it shall be given. Lord, I'm praying for a blessing over Brother Koto. For that yes say, may he be blessed. For the saints that are standing on their feet, amening Father, I'm now using the office of the pastor of the local assembly. I'm now using the ordination you gave me to speak a blessing on these people. May doors open before them. Bless them in their families. Heal them of their sicknesses. Improve their spiritual life. Fill them with the Holy Ghost. Make them model Christians. Help them with their financial problems. Help them with their marriage problems. Help them with their work problems. Help them with their health problems, Father. I pray, Heavenly Father, let it be remembered that upon this service, a blessing was spoken. A blessing was pronounced. Give them a church of their own. Give them a tabernacle of their own. 
where they can let their children play, where they can come for services without being worried, without fearing nothing. Lord, give them cars to come to the service with. Give them nice homes. Lord, after listening to the tapes, after listening to the message, after coming from missionary work, Lord, they've got nice beds to sleep on. They've got a nice roof above them, Heavenly Father. Above all, give them eternal life, Father. We want to continue this service beyond the curtain of time. We want to continue with our testimony meetings beyond the curtain of time. May there never be negativity in our midst. Make us one, Lord Jesus. The Holy Ghost is happy. The Holy Ghost is pleased. When a church receives the word, that pleases God. I challenge you, if you have got something against your fellow brother or sister, after this service, go and make it right. If you have got negativity in your heart, go make it right. Or you stay with that forever. We are in an atmosphere.